when we are all asleep in the room, then he comes to where I'm sleeping. When he sees that I'm asleep, then he tries to use that advantage to sleep with me. But I wake up, so I don't allow him. At times, too, when no one is in the house, then it's only the two of us. Then he told me that I should allow him to do one. He won't tell anybody about it. This is the distressing story of 16-year-old Maushi, not her real name. She has been forced to endure this abuse on countless occasions. This nightmare began when she lost her mother at a tender age. Maushi assumed she would be loved and cared for, but she's had to endure chains and strings of sexual harassment and unsolicited touches from her auntie's husband. The place she hoped would be a safe haven for her is now a place of torment. At times he tries to sleep with me, but if I don't allow him, then he changes mood towards me. He gives me money that I should allow him to sleep with me. If I don't, then he takes back the money from me. Reporting sexual harassment can be a difficult decision, especially for minors. The fear of being victimized and stigmatized by society forces many young girls to recoil. Accusing her auntie's husband of harassment was difficult, but she gathered a lot of strength and confronted the issue. Sadly, her auntie did not take her disclosure seriously. The first time we started, I told my auntie that she didn't believe me. She thought I was telling lies because I was a small girl. And she was always saying that there's a small girl like me. I don't know anything, so I shouldn't be saying that. The harassment persisted after she reported to her auntie. And eventually, her auntie witnessed the truth. Eh, uh, the last day okay. Miss me the minute to film. Shade. Okay. So pass papa and person neda. Neda. The minute to film, mummy who sign this say. Or person or 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 yes. Maybe son I will say. Or now I will get to be baby baby ahead. No no one yet is free. Son I papa na catch them. Iya no person or Ben I will learn. Mhm. Or person or Ben. Sakolanada. Tell no person or Ben. In fact, what made her believe Maushi's story was that her own sister, who once lived with them, also complained of similar sexual advances from her husband. Mister Obetram and Chen. Obetram and Chen. Obetram and Chen, be one year. Or no sooner you're not complaining, sir. I tell me. Say, Papa, and person need be. Young Cassa, tell me, let's not cast on. I said, Me need baby, yea, person, me, man, and person, me, a baby, dinner, the Nanka must fit my finishing. I say, Sir, near man, or ye, 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 People who commit sexual abuses often target vulnerable individuals due to poverty, age, gender, or disability. Poverty is among the root causes of sexual harassment and makes it difficult for victims to report it. I told my grandmother, then my mother's two sisters, they are four. So, all of in fact, the family members, my mom's side, they all know about it. What did you tell them? I told them what the man has been doing to me in the house. And I, my, as for my grandmom, I told her that the mom, the mom tries to sleep with me. Anytime there's no one in the house or we are asleep. I asked me, yes, my report. It's... I said, I'm going to say, dear mommy. I'm going to say, 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 I'm going to
Sexual harassment can have a significant and long-lasting impact on victims' mental and physical health. Maushi is traumatized by the harassment, and the painful experiences are robbing her of a happy childhood. Whenever he comes home, they will be insulting me. Even if I've not done anything, they will be insulting me. They will be telling me that I'm a witch. I came to the family to destroy the family. They used to be saying that when I finish PC, I should pack my things and get out from the house. When he's around, I'm not comfortable. So anytime he's in the house, I get out from the house. Either to my friend's house or I'll, I'll be working in the area, just like that. It's even affecting my studies because at times when I go to school, that's the only thing I'm thinking about. Maushi is in her final year. In a matter of weeks, the 16-year-old would be sitting for the Basic Education Certificate Examination, BCE. It is a life-defining test in keeping her dream of becoming a nurse aloft. But that dream is ebbing away by the day. I'm in Form 3 and it's over two weeks for us to go right to BEC. But I don't know how I'm going to prepare for the BEC. Why? Because I'm wearing school fees and registration fee. And the equipment for me to write the BEC, I don't even have one. When I add the school fees and the registration fee together, I'm only 470. Unfortunately, her auntie's business has collapsed, making it difficult to foot her niece's school bills. My auntie takes care of me, but she can't provide the financial needs for me. As for him, doesn't take care of me, takes care of his children, because he says I'm not part of his children. Kind of 4.7. I'm here saying me go so she's scared and we say me saka. I go to church and I'm much, I'm much less. I say yeah, pamu. I say come with me. I go so much church and I'm, I'm afraid school. But me nyanya nyanya sky. I say me do masse. I me tom tom anto sine. I me go to lobby na abomeka. Ti ama matu. Ti ama me say me me nyanya do ma ibia. Maushi is constantly sacked for BEC registration and school fees of 470 Ghana cities. She's living with anxiety due to the uncertainty of her future. Despite the adversities thrown at her, Maushi is determined to succeed in her academic pursuit. Monday I went to school, they sacked me. Tuesday too I went, they sacked me. Then today too I went. Um, I want to go because I said it some few weeks for us to go right to BC. And my teacher too told me that this the rest of the week we are going to use to solve past questions. So I want to be there so that I'll know the part of questions they are answering. That's how I've been going to school. Well with the academic performance, um, excellence. She she's very good. In fact, all the subjects. Yeah, she doesn't have every subject like that, but she is good in all the subjects in terms of expression and stuff, she, she's very okay. It's all about um, financial, financially. Sometimes when she comes to school, she doesn't have money for feeding, sometimes not even pocket money. When she, when she comes to school, sometimes she feels so down, but she's someone that she knows, she knows what is, she's going for. So anytime you see her, she's learning. Anytime you see her, she's learning. Even though she'll be in a sad mood, but she, she forced to do something for herself. All I want is so my mother help me pay my school fees and send me to school so that I will become a, a, a permanent person in the future. With the auntie now unable to protect her from the husband, Maushi also needs state shelter for the time being. Emmanuel Jivenu's report for Joy Prime. Those that know you who trust in you, not in horses and chariots, but they are more flesh. No man can prevail. Ask Abraham and Sarah with the woman with the issue of blood. 
Nothing, nothing hard for you, 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 you. Ask mama, no blind bacterias. Make it go as they shall light. Nothing hard for you, you, you. No man, no man, no man. My confidence is you. All is hard, all is hard for you. It's can never ever resist to you. You do not lie, you do not feel. All is hard for you to do. It doesn't exist to. It can never ever resist to. You do not lie, you do not feel. What is hard for you to do? It doesn't exist. It can never ever exist. To.